Hey guys, so it's been 6 months since the launch of the Sony WF-1000XM4. Since then, there had been some firmware updates and for a long time, these were my daily drivers. No kidding, I was driving them every single day. And in this video, I'm going to share with you my thoughts after 6 months of using them, including some stuff that I haven't discovered before. I feel that even now, the Sony WF-1000XM4 remains one of the best wireless earbuds in the industry. I remember back in 2017 when I reviewed the first WF-1000X. That product was so far behind compared to the competition of that day, but it's amazing how much progress Sony has made since with the XM4 earbuds. Now you'll be hard pressed to find anything at this price point that can match the XM4's noise cancelling, its high res certified sound, its features, and its small compact size. Fits right into the pocket over here. Yes, it's not for coins anymore, I claim that pocket for earbuds. <laughs> if you need more details about the XM4's features, check out this video over here. So if you've got the XM4's over the holidays, rest assured that even now I see it as a fantastic purchase. There is also something that I wasn't aware of, shout out to Collier on my Discord server for this find. Apparently, the XM4's are also compatible with Google's Find My Device feature, which is something along the lines of Apple's Find My AirPods. So if you lose your XM4s, the app points you to its last known location, the location where it was last connected to your phone. Of course, this only works on Android devices. It does have some issues though, for example, on this channel, we discuss a lot about the Sony's phone call quality. And despite what Sony says about the XM4's microphone array, its bone conduction sensor, I can't say in good faith that it's good. It's acceptable in quiet scenarios like if you're taking calls in a quiet space, then you won't have any issues with its clarity. But in noisy places, the amount of background noise that gets through the microphones is simply too much, such that even cheaper earbuds right now have microphone quality that sounds more pleasing and more quiet in noisy places. There is one thing that I hadn't noticed till recently, that is, sudden loud high frequency noises tend to disrupt its transparency mode. I found out about this when I went shopping for groceries and I turned on ambient sound mode because I wanted to hear what the cashier is saying. And as she was scanning the items, beep, 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 it seemed like with every beep, the XM4's transparency was stuttering, like it stopped for a brief moment, then it comes back on. With every beep, it doesn't happen with full ANC only with ambient sound mode. I thought that was rather interesting because other earbuds don't seem to have this issue. Perhaps this is something Sony can look into fixing if it's possible to fix at all with a future software update. Oh yeah, speaking of updates, there hasn't been a software update for the XM4s in like 5 months. I mean, I was really looking forward to Sony improving the XM4s call quality because to me, that is actually the number one thing, holding back the XM4s from true greatness. If they can make its call quality, its microphone pickup as clean as the Sound Quality Liberty 3 Pros, these are gonna be so much more popular in my opinion. Still, like I said in the beginning, if call quality isn't a big priority for you, these are still one of the best out there right now. Is it still worth paying $280 for them? Well, considering that in the last 6 months, the competition has gotten a lot stiffer and will continue to get stiffer in the next year, I'd say try to at least get them on a small discount. I'm talking $10, $20. It's not likely that these will have heavy discounts anytime soon because Sony seems to have settled for a 2-year product cycle. For example, it took 2 years since the XM3s for the XM4s to arrive, and so it might be 
perhaps another year or so before we see any news about the WF-1000XM5. So if you want to stay in the loop in case there are any news about the XM5 earbuds, hit subscribe and tap the bell button so that you never miss another video from me. Thanks for watching, appreciate your time. If you like this video, please smash like and share. Also, a big shout out to these legends who support this channel by contributing a dollar or more per month through the crowdfunding website, Patreon. If you want to be a legend too, it's very simple. All you gotta do is to support my work on Patreon. That is a great way to help keep this show going and you gain some pretty cool rewards too, like having your name displayed at the end of every video. So link is in the box down below if you want to help support. I've also got a Discord server. Do join if you want to hang out or just chat. More videos coming up soon, so don't go away.